My name is Julia Swan and I am the Public Relations and Outreach Coordinator at the Burke Museum. Typical week at the Burke Museum in my position uh, is usually um, dependent on what's going on at the museum. So if we have an exhibit opening then I'm doing a lot of work on um, creating press material, contacting journalists, updating our website, using Facebook, things like that to get the word out about that exhibit. Same goes for any events we have going on. Um, I also spend a lot of time working on outreach events, um, different things to kind of raise our visibility on the University of Washington campus with students. I get to be involved in practically everything that's happening. Um, you know, whether it's an event or an exhibit, or whether it's you know, an interesting research story that one of our curators is working on. Um, I get to work with those other people at the museum. I get to learn about what they're doing. I get to be involved in their work. And I get to help um, communicate what we do at the museum to the public. I really like that feeling of satisfaction I get when 3,000 people come to Dino Day, and I know that that was largely because of what I was able to do to help people find out about it. So it's satisfying. Communications work is not something I ever thought I would be doing, actually. Um, I'm a graduate of the museology program as well, and um, while I was a student, ended up uh, accepting a work-study position working for the Burke Communications Office and learned a lot of skills on the job about public relations and marketing. You know, I never took a course in museum communications, but um, realized when I started working that I had a lot of the skills necessary to do that job well. We have strong writing skills, good understanding of how to use technology, you know, those are things that um, I think lots of students have and may not realize apply to the types of positions that are available in the communications field. Get involved in as many places and in as many ways as you can. Um, you know, in my experience, I had a couple of different work-study jobs, I was doing internships at different places, and in the end, one of them led to a, a, a position in the field. Um, and I think that is the best way to set yourself up for employment when you graduate. Um, you know, spend time making connections with people, broaden your skills, even beyond something you thought you would want to be doing, and you might discover that you're really good at something that you weren't expecting. Going beyond the classroom and finding opportunities to get involved at different museums and different projects that you think are interesting is probably the best piece of advice I could give. One museum visit that really stands out in my head was um, to the Tate Modern in London. They're just a really fantastic modern art museum that I just remember really enjoying and thinking, man, I want to work in a place like this. So, but a favorite is hard to choose. There's so many good ones.